Here's a short tutorial on the preparation of project files. To work with Unitizer Basic, you will need to have a collection of single images, preferably in the TEF format, which are sequentially named, all in a project folder, which has some meaningful name for you. Usually this will be a client, a case, a party, a department, or some other specific protocol used by your firm. An example is an output file I've created for another project. So this is called output. And as you can see, the documents inside there are basically sequentially named image files. I'll show you one way that you can handle it. We have this output folder. And how I have run the OCR is I've run it against the TIFFs inside the output folder and I put the OCRs in a subfile. And that seems to work just fine. So that'll hold your OCRs while you're processing the other documents. We've put these in the order of use, or most logical use, if you were coming from PDF originals. Each of these programs will be explained in more detail later, but a good workflow could be to, if for example, if you're starting with a PDF file from archives or from your vendor, which is often the case, you could use PDF Stamper to create a small Bates label on the pages of the PDF file. You could also put a confidential stamp someplace on each page. There are a lot of options with that program. From there, you could use PDF to TIFF to convert your individual pages of your PDF into TIFF image files. If you don't like the file name schema you started with, use Simple Renamer to rename your file sequentially with a different prefix or other identification information. Or you can start your numbering at the next in line number to add these files to a previous project. Then finally, after you've unitized your images and created the DII file, you can OCR these project images using Otter OCR. When you're complete, you can upload your project folder with the images and OCR documents in the same folder as your summation default site, usually the summation images folder under the main directory for your case. This is where Summation will look for your images once the DII file is uploaded to Summation. 